Unfortunately, we don't have a lot of history on this place. Um, a lot of files just have gone missing over the years. Um, was it 06? They shut it down, 2006. Um, it's just been sitting empty since. So, not knowing which room was used for which part of the family, Matt and Mike just kind of decided that this is the children's room and that's the master. Um, this room is very active with various um, forms of activity. Okay. That up there was where they would take up prisoners for the gallows. Oh, up on the roof. Oh. But so it's unknown how many, how many times it was actually. So, yeah, this is the same as the master. Um, I believe a lot of the furniture came from. I want to say Mike's mother-in-law. Yeah, that's what he told me. Yeah, I think that's his, his mother-in-law. That a lot of it came from. Um, from what I've heard, I personally have not had experiences in here yet, but stories I have heard has been, again with the shadow figures, the touching. Um, I get again a little bit, not maybe not aggressive, but a little bit more threatening. I've heard people uh, report. This is this was used as evidence locker in here, okay. and it was still being used as a jail or prison. They have turned it into a scrying room. Gotcha. Um, old, old piano that is believed to be the one that was here being used for Sunday service. And down here we have some more exciting parts, which is watch your step here. We'll start. And down here we have some more exciting parts, which is watch your step here. We'll start. And down here we have some more exciting parts, which is watch your step here. We'll start in here to the hot tank. So here we have our cells. For me personally, the most interesting cell is the back right one. This is the cell where an inmate can himself. And it is believed that he is still very much here. Um, it might be tough to tell tonight how cold it actually gets in here. It can get very, very cold. Um, when he was here, when, when it was in use, not just for him but for everyone, it was just a very, very cold cell and they for some reason couldn't keep it warm. They had to provide like extra blankets and jackets just to keep the inmates warm. Um, and it's, it seems that maybe he triggers that, the temperature change. Um, during summer, it's very clear when you're in here and the temperature just drops. It's very clear. Um, I doubt you'll be able to feel it tonight. Uh, across the hall in the other one is where people will see uh, shadow figures and hearing like tapping noises, footsteps, like, like dragging of feet. There. You saw a shadow figure. In that the was the very room. first place I ever saw a shadow figure. So. Yeah. Um, in the women's cell, people have been reporting being touched. Uh, one guy walked out with a massive bruise on his leg. Oh, wow. Um, that he didn't have when they came in. So you can definitely have the, like, the physical reactions. They can affect you quite a bit. Um, but you'll... You might feel the pushing, the pulling of hair, especially in the women's cell. Thank you. So I put down there. And I know her upstairs in the pool. 
portal room to do an immersion session. It's like an impression of a couple. They're fighting. I don't know, she got hurt, he did something. He's very regretful. What did he do? I have like here, I feel here, like back of my head, something. It's almost like there's voices in this noise, but I can't make them out. Can you slow down your speech, talk to Elle slowly and clearly, so that she can hear you and understand you? Apron. Kind of apron. But there's like a woman with blood on it. It's like almost a like June Cleaver image. Like 19, I don't know. Maybe 40s, maybe earlier than that. Like pin, kind of like pin curl hair. Do I have anybody here with me right now? Do you remember me? I'm Debbie. I'm Debbie, I was here a few weeks ago. I don't know if time means anything to you, but. very much like to talk to you again. So, do we have a Minnie and an Emma? Minnie and Emma, are you still here? Are you still here? Are you still here? Minnie and Emma, do you feel remorse for your crime? Do we have a John Henry? Nathan Taylor? Nathan Taylor. Nathan Taylor. Do we have a Glover or a Lemmy? Who was the gentleman down in the bottom cell who hung himself? You guys done a lot of trouble over moonshine. And then we have some moonshine outside we could bring in and sneak it in for you. What do you think? Well, my friend Belle is upstairs with Anne, my other friend, and I would like you to give them a message for me. Would you tell them to say my name? Protecting me the 
last time I was here. Set that music box up. When my friends come down, we'll play you some music if you set that music box up. Do we have Nathan Taylor? Set that music box up. Do you think you could go upstairs and touch L on the leg to draw the knee? Sure, right. Ready, my child? Oh, it's like here. Pound, pounding, like an ache. It's like my leg, I got like sh shooting here. If you see me jump, it's because like I feel like something or some pain or touching me, not like really pain, just like. I don't know. When my friends come down, we'll play you some music if you set that music box up. Flux. Okay, you've got the flux. Come further down here. Come down here to me in this cell. See if you can find the music box. It's close to me. John Henry. John Henry, who are you? What did you do? You hurt somebody.
I'm going to switch this off, okay? I'll switch it back on, and if you still want to play with it, you can do. I'm going to go walk down here. Don't forget. Mini and Emma. I'd like you to go and talk to Elle. Is that the woman's cell? No. Okay, here's the woman's cell. I'm gonna sit in here for a moment. Alright. Who are you? Who's here? What did you do with your days and nights? Can you light any of these up again? That's a book. Okay. Is there somebody on the bed? So it's a cell we picked somebody up on the SLS. Who's here? I don't see you, I don't have that special camera. Tell me your name, please. Could you do that? Does anybody have any message they would like to give me? Help. Like, help us or something. How can we help you? But you need to tell me what you need. Did you lock the door? I locked the door. So like they keep repeating that. Did you lock the door? Did you lock the door? This is of note because in a previous investigation, we captured an EVP of a female voice saying, did you lock the door? After I had said those same words, but off camera earlier that night, which in itself was strange enough. I'll show you how dark it is. Okay. Turn around. Turn back. A bit blurry because I was moving the camera now. There's the seat. There it is. 
Who was the gentleman in this cell? I hear that the gentleman in this cell hung himself right there at that ladder. And I'm sorry that you fell. That was your best alternative. But I also heard that you were here for rape. Multiple rape. But I also heard that you were here for rape. Multiple rape. But I also heard that you were here for rape. Multiple rape. Is that true? What was it like in this jail? It seems like the conditions were extremely harsh. It's very cold right now. I can't imagine what it would be like having to live here in these conditions. I don't know if that's a dog outside barking. Do you think you can find that music box again for me? It's 2024. Could you tell me what year it is for you? How about your family? Do you have a wife, children, grandchildren? Like a kind of like evil laugh, like when they did something bad and like ha 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 ha, like a, like they got away with it. It's a male. I'm going to reach out my hand and you can touch my hand you can hold my hand if you would like would you like to hold my hand? I know I'm just an old English lady probably not much to look at <laughs> I'm just scratching my itchy chin okay would you like to step forward and touch my hand? you have permission to touch my hand no permission to hurt me. I've seen. Come on, you can come closer. That's fine. My head got very cold though. Are you there? I don't know if you're there. Can you touch my hand? Okay, I'm gonna let you into secret. Shh. I'm 57 years old. Can you go and tell Elle? Or send someone and tell them that I'm 57 years old? Oh, they're done, they're coming now. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna carry on with a little team investigation, I think. So thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I enjoyed your company, even though you spooked me out a little bit. And I'm sorry about that. I'm a big baby sometimes in the dark. But thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, we're finishing up. This is our last session before we pack up and go home. Well, back to our Airbnb. Does anybody have any last messages they would like to give to us? <laughs> that was their favorite toy last time. 
Do we know what kind of music you want to play for? No, I gave them some options and they didn't play along to let me know which one. Do you think that you could find that white round toy that you played with earlier? Or something that just touched my head? music you want us to play for you. What did you think of my singing? I just sang for them. I just out of the blue, just a song popped into my head and I just started singing. Yeah. Which song? Sweet dreams, something or other. Sweet dreams or something. Find you. That one. I don't know many words to it. Sweet dreams of sunbeams find you. Sweet dreams of when your worries be oh, you. that one. I don't know many words, but it just popped Dream of the dream of me. That's it. That's it. That's what it's called. Why did that one catch sound? Dream of the dream of me. Would you please just come near that round white object? in the hallway here so we can attempt to communicate is that thank that, you that was that Come same down. that was that same yep that I had is that thank you that was that Come same down. that was that same yep that I had Thank you. That was that Come same. Down. That was that same yep that I had. Mm -hmm. If you think it wasn't fair that you were here, come out of your room. Show us. We know they don't always get it right. But you got to stand up for yourself. You have to let somebody know. Is that just something that went by the window up there? Did you see that, Ellen? I know I wasn't looking there. Mm. I wasn't. I was looking at the blue. Come on down here, please. If you're here unjustly, let us know by touching anything. If you stay quiet, nobody will ever know your story. Is there anything we can bring for you the next time you return? I almost feel like there's a breathing coming out of that room. Mm -hmm. We're going to be leaving here very soon. I see you in there. Yeah. You see him? I did. Oh, 
light some shadow movement in the darkness, but you know. John Henry. John Henry, could you step forward, please? Why are you still here? Do you choose to be here? Ooh. You okay? What's the matter? Cold. Like a breeze. Yeah. Mm. Was that you, John Henry? That kind of took me by surprise. You okay? Yeah, I'm just like yeah, completely I'm chilled chill. now. Did you just get it? Yeah, on the left hand side. Oh, are you running through my friends? It's like it's circling around. Yeah. Do you see us? Can you see us? Who are we to you? Who do we appear to be? Could you tell us what is special about this jail? Why is this jail so different? Why are there no cells with bars? Why is it all like solitary confinement? Having no windows to look out and see outside. Yeah, what was that? Did you get to see your family? Were you born in Cochrane? Ooh, thank you. Give you a little bit of the chills when you're in the dark and these yeah. music boxes go off. <laughs> Could you do that again? You found the other one. Thank you. See, I knew you liked that one. That's your favorite toy. And it is time for us to say that is time. 20 minutes. Wow. Now you want to talk. Well, come, come a little closer. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment and subscribe if you haven't already. And please consider becoming a member to support the channel and get early access to videos and exclusive content.